Let's take a look at the lesson, subtract two numbers, double digits up to 100. It says subtract nine minus one. So we can draw nine dots, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and we can subtract or take away one of them. How many do we have left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So nine minus one is equal to eight. Next we have three minus two. One, two, three, and then we take two of them away. One, two. How many do we have left? Just one. The next problem is five minus one. But if we have five and we take one away from it, it will just be the number before five. What number comes before five? Yes, four. Let's see why this works. One, two, three, four, five. Well, when I cross this one off, I'm only going to count up to this number now. One, two, three, four. It is the number right before five. Now I have two minus one. Well, if I have two and I just cross one of them off, I will still have one left. Can you point to the one down below? Yes, it's right there. The next one shows six minus five. All right, so we can draw six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we can cross off five of them because we are subtracting or taking away five. One, two, three, four, five. There is just one left. All right, here is the one. Here we have six minus three. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we're going to take away three. One, two, three. There are one, two, three left. I know that answer is reasonable because I know that three plus three is six. So if we take away one of our threes, we will only be left with three. All right, here's our answer. Next, we have six minus one. One, two, three, four, five, six, and I'm going to subtract one. I'm left with one, two, three, four, five. Six minus one is equal to five. Now we have six minus five. One, two, three, four, five, six, and we would take five of them away or cross five of them off. One, two, three, four, Five. We are left with one, so six minus five is equal to one. Next we have seven minus two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and we take two of them away. One, two. We're left with one, two, three, four, five. And I know that is reasonable because five plus two is seven. So seven minus two would be equal to five. Now we have six minus one. I could draw dots for this, or I could look at it and think, well, if I drew six dots and then I crossed one of them off, I would just have one less than six. What is one less than six? The number right before six. Yes, five. So six minus one is equal to five which is right here. Thank you for all the help, friends.